We are situated about eight miles west of New York City at MetLife Stadium in East Rutherford. But tonight, we've got a good AFC matchup on tap as it'll be the Baltimore Ravens taking on the New York Jets. Here's a punter, Thomas Morstead, to get this one started. And off we go from MetLife Stadium. Devin Duvernay now returning from the end zone. The lane opens here. He's past the 30. Devin Duvernay. It's a foot race. And they are not going to catch him. He's in. Touchdown, Ravens. That was a special return, and it happened because he's a special returner. He has to have that approval from his special teams coach's head coach to bring it out of the end zone. But let's be honest, a lot of times where they bring it out of the end zone like he did there, they don't have approval. I mean, I think a lot of times they do, but correct me if I'm wrong, sometimes it's just a guy getting a feel, right? You're exactly right. What's the old adage? Sometimes you just have to know when to break the rules. And if you do, you're taking on some responsibility. But he was happy to do so there. Tucker with the extra point. And it's now a 7-0 game. So let's try this again. After the kick return TD, here's yet another kickoff. Hardman going to bring it out of the end zone. And he's able to get this across the 20, but not by much, as he's marked out officially at the 21. At their own 21 yard line. Play action. It's Rodgers. Oh, he's going to take a shot right away. And that's caught inside the 35. That all the way in. Touchdown, New York. Alan Lazard, 79 yards. And the Jets are able to strike quickly here. <sighs> in for six. That's a great really, response. Really you give up the first score of the game, but you go right down yourselves and get the equalizer. I just had a flashback there. I remember playing in a game like that in college where one of my teammates had said in the media that week, the opposite team would be lucky to cross our goal oh, line. Man. They crossed it in the first minute of the game. Like our me, first bro. offensive play, we scored to answer back. Really Something really similar to what we just saw there. Very it's similar to what we just saw. So we'll leave it at good, seven bro. now that's as they kick it away. 18, Duvernay now gonna bring it out. I couldn't get the other nigga down. And able to oh, take it past the 25 and heart. up to the 28 yard line. Oh, it's an ass me, bro. This fucking me, bro. Jackson and the Ravens come up now first and ten at their own 28 yard line. They'll start on the ground with Dobbins. And that to the 30. It'll be second down. Give credit to the defense for stringing that play out. And they gave up no cutback angle. You know he was trying to dart through. No place for him to go. A nice job there, only giving up a three-yard gain. Here's second and seven. Play action. Now Jackson. That's going deep for Bateman. Still got it. That's caught at the 25. It's a big play there for Baltimore. 46 yards. Despite writing it down on my notes, I never give enough credit to the offensive line, and we have to here. The protection, that's what made this play a success. Quarterback had to wait for his crossing route to develop, and that takes a little bit of extra time. Excellent job by the big fellas up there. Now remember. And he probably should have given that one off as he's going to get hit and taken down behind the line. They'll have to deal with a second and 14 now after the loss. They go play action now. Jackson. Oh, well, that'll be incomplete. Well, he took a shot as he let that go. And it's going to bring up a third down. I think he had to hold that one before he wanted to. He was right up in his grill. I think he was a dentist there without a license, don't you? throw and he'll be hit as he releases it and that'll fall incomplete 
This defense has certainly played well so far in this game, and the coverage has been tight on just about every throw. Forced a few here so far in this game. Why does that go slow? Brings up fourth down. Tucker's kick is good, and they take the lead here now at 10 to 7. So they're able to end that. Ah, <laughs> shit, crazy. I didn't even know near me on the read option. I was already on the line. You know, he's every drive shit, with crazy. points. Most quarterbacks would tell you, let's end it with a kick, right? A PAT. Yeah, they really killed my spirit, though, bro. I might have washed my hands. Yeah. Really come back, come back, come back. Come back, come back. And get prepared for the rest of the game. I already killed my spirit, bro. That's who Katie killed my spirit, bro. That shit, that's so trash. That whole worse than 18. Niggas talking about the game the best ever because y'all got high ass three balls, bro. Jets offense coming up now to start their next drive. Well, partner, you know, coaches always say that every play is designed dare, to score I a touchdown. Dare, Sometimes dare, that's not I really dare, true, but I last drive, that was right. the case. One play to get into the what? end zone, and now they'll try to duplicate that success here. And it's rare for those moments to happen. Incredible when they do. And you saw the celebration. Pure, unbridled joy after that one. Well, they didn't get a whole lot out of that one, but I think you've got to continue to try and run it and try and keep the defense honest. You mean or else they'll just sit back, dare you to throw it on every down? Yeah, you get your quarterback hit a lot that way, too. Now a play fake. Rodgers. All right, rifles one, and that's going to be intercepted. Picked up by Patrick Queen. And this return is going to be halted right around the 28-yard line. After the interception, here's Jackson. Caught left side, it's Beckham. And taking it to the 15-yard line before he's brought down. That one good for 13 and a Raven first down. Defensively going forward, they're going to have to watch out for him on plays just like that. It's a drag route across the field, and they're trying to free him up and let him run after the catch. That won't be the last time we see that play, and it works there to pick up a first down. On first and ten, it's Jackson. Flushed out right. And he will go down outside of the pocket for a sack. Tried to get away, but could not. Now whistles come in. We're going to get a timeout here by the offense. They'll have two remaining as we step aside here in this first quarter. Throwing on second and long. Jackson. Looking for the end zone. That is caught. It's Bateman for a Raven touchdown. Rashad Bateman, 29 yards, as his guys are able to extend their lead. Well, that's what I call an answer right there. They gave up a sack on the previous play. How about what they did to finish things off, turning it right back around? That's the response, and that O-line feels a lot better now, don't they? Yeah, without a doubt, because give up the sack in the previous play, that just hurts those guys, because they never want to see their guy get hit. Tucker now to kick it away following the touchdown. Hardman going to bring it out of the end zone. And he's going to be out of bounds on the return. Not a great return. They'll start back around the 17. The New York offense taking over for their next possession. Been a little bit of an interesting start. The first drive for him, Charles, they had the passing touchdown. The second drive, he threw the interception. So we'll see what this third drive of the ball game brings. Yeah, it's got a tiebreaker, isn't it? <laughs> I mean, that's a tough part for them and for him because, yeah, things went really well on that first one, not so well on the second one. He wants to get back to what he did to get this game going. Zone coverage there, and they were playing deep. That makes it obviously a little bit harder to run by guys. And that time, there's not much of a window to get the ball in there, and it winds up incomplete. And he'll let this go deep for Lazard. Room here to run. How about this? And a terrific return as he takes this thing all the way down near the 20-yard line. Well, they're certainly not giving much up to the defense, are they? Because for the second time now, that D has had to run back out on the field early after an interception. And remember, on the last drive, the opposing side took it in for six after that interception. Jackson on first down. Forced out to his left. 
And this is caught. Touchdown, Baltimore. J.K. Dobbins, a 22-yard touchdown grab. Shit too easy, bro. Shit too easy. Niggas not fucking with me for real. Boy, still in the first quarter. Shit too easy, and look bro. Out. I mean, they are on pace Daddy, I can't even be happy, bro. 2K killed my fucking spirit. There, can't even be happy. To watch so far. Told That's niggas this shit too easy on this man shit, bro. Niggas is not fucking with me. I've been undefeated. I lost one game and been undefeated ever since. Literally us. We haven't lost a game together. Niggas is not fucking with me on this hoe, bro. Should be too easy, niggas. Be weak as fuck. And that one will bounce out of the back of the end zone, so we will start here at the 25. The New York offense taking over for their next possession. Well, still early in this one, Charles, but the last time this offense was out there, they threw their first interception of the ball game, so trying to avoid repeating that mistake here on this drive. And to put a positive spin on it, at least it happened in the first half and not in a close game in the fourth quarter, but you're absolutely right, partner. One of the last things this offensive quarterback wants to witness again in this game. Kind of an obvious question, Charles, but anything you try to avoid after your first pick or you say it's one interception, we're still in the first half, we're going to do the same thing. I think you want to avoid playing scared, you know, and put it into the mind of the quarterback that you've lost confidence in him. Make sure you get some throws that he's going to be able to complete, make him feel good about himself, and continue to run your offense. Now Rodgers. And the Raven pressure too much. Down he goes. So they take the flag and the yardage that comes with it. Rodgers now on first down. They have pressure coming, and they got him once again. Gotta imagine the pass rush will be equally intense here on second down following the sack. It's second and 18. Here's Rodgers. He's got a man. It's his fullback. They get 11 back on that one. It leads to third down. Throwing his Rodgers on third down. Pass taken in by his big tight end. And he is going to have a Jets first down as they're able to get the third down conversion. That's good for a Jets first down. First and 10 at the 41 yard line. 26. Now Rodgers. And Rodgers intercepted a third time. Kyle Hamilton picks it. And the Ravens force the turnover. And they'll take over at the 10. Well, I'm not sure that the wheels, Charles, are coming completely off, but they're shaking a little bit. That's three interceptions, and now interceptions here on back-to-back -back drives. And I think about what a Hall of Fame coach told me that he always told his teams, when a mistake happens, just move on to the next play. Let it go. Hard to do when you throw this many interceptions. That's exactly the attitude that has to be adopted. It's trash, bro. The Baltimore Fucking offense trash. at the line set to get going. They have to be pleased with the way that they've moved the football thus far. And why wouldn't they be? Two touchdowns on a field goal in their first three possessions. They're playing so well right now. The field goal Fucking probably trash, feels like a disappointment. Bro. And mark him down way up close to the 40 at the 39. They'll throw on first down with Jackson. He'll swing this out to Dobbins. And he'll be taken down across the 50 at the 45 in enemy territory. So I weak ass is on somewhere, bro. I prove every time I get on this game, niggas can't fuck with me, bro. It's that simple.